Hello students, welcome to our class of Automata. In today's class, we are going to discuss about a special type of CFG or context free grammar, also known as Chomsky normal form or CNF. There is nothing new in any CNF, basically, it is a new type of production rule and uh, at the end of our discussion, we are also going to learn how we can convert any CNF to, uh, sorry, so, uh, C, CFG to a CNF or Chomsky normal form. Now, a CFG is a Chomsky normal form if every rule has one of this form, A arrow B C or A arrow A. That means our left symbol. Uh, will be a non-terminal and at the right symbol we are going to have two non-terminal or this this is one type of rule or maybe a arrow small a that means uh, at the left side we are having uh, non-terminal and at the right side we are having a terminal character now a can be any terminal and ABC are um, variable but sometimes also called non terminal. Now, this is called Chomsky normal form. Now, whenever we are going to have any CFG or context free grammar, then it is very easy to convert it to some CNF or Chomsky normal form. Now, maybe we have a CFG like this A uh, sorry A arrow 0 A and A arrow 0 A B now in the first rule we have A arrow 0 A but uh, according to CNF we can have only two non terminals at the right side or only one terminal uh, sorry two non terminal at the right side or only one uh, terminal character at the right side now here we have one non terminal a and one terminal zero so we are going to define this rule like this that uh, a arrow 0 a now we are replacing this 0 by t that means we are introducing uh, one new uh, non terminal that means t arrow z uh, 0 and our new rule will become a arrow t a so this is in the form of a arrow b c and this is in the form of a arrow a okay now for the second rule uh, we have a arrow 0 uh, a b sorry a arrow 0 a b so we are uh, writing it down a arrow 0 a b and I am replacing this 0 a by uh, this 0 a by capital Z ok now my new rule will become a arrow capital Z B and Z arrow 0 A. Now we already have defined T arrow 0 so that means we can put this T instead of 0 so our rule will become Z arrow T A. Ok. So our final rule will be S arrow T A t arrow 0 z uh, a arrow so this is our rule this is our rule this is our rule and this is also our rule so in three rules uh, we can define this CFG to our desired CNF. Okay, thank you.